They're going to see me every day during the election. They're a parasite. session here so be rude to interrupt so what, what well your bank is complicit in evicting their uh, families in distressed mortgages onto the streets your bank is responsible for bringing this country to its knees your bank was bailed out by the people of this country so maybe Richie Boucher should come down here and have a word with us well, Richie Boucher, you know, he wanted to go, he wanted to go rave on and rave on. Richie Boucher was part of the problem and what happened in this country, you know. And Richie Boucher had no problem digging his hands into air pockets to get taxpayers' money to bail this kip out. Now, Richie Boucher now has no problem in evicting families onto the streets. Now, there's such thing as called uh, humanity and a bit of compassion, you know. Your bank doesn't seem to understand that. You know, we have thousands of families, they're now living in hostels, hotels, now, because your bank has gone back in to look for their money back. What happens if we come in and start looking for our money back? No, no, key, key, key remember, end is worse. This is the best little country in the world to do business in. It's not the best little country in the world to live in. So, you know, this country only gives about... We land our money for the big people in the world, for the 1%. That's all we do. 
We are breaking. We are breaking. We're breaking, 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 breaking humanitarian laws. Extend the light of laws. Well, protesters are back outside. Okay, just let you know. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> 